Elwood box is probably the most ambitious of the box hops here in Rockbridge, Ohio. This is the newest shipping container home by Seth and Emily Britt, and it is absolutely beautiful. It is two 40-foot shipping containers that are suspended over a seasonal waterfall that we're actually standing in right now. There's not any flowing water at the moment, but it still looks incredible hanging over mm -hmm. this cast that goes down into the property. They laid these massive metal I-beams across the chasm to be able to support the whole structure. And they made sure to integrate it into the property itself, making it feel like a truly special escape. And not only that, but they've styled it very specifically to give a unique vibe, both inside and outside. Yes, and specifically, it is a mid-century modern theme. So I'm so excited for you to see the inside and there's a surprise, but first, on the outside, when you walk up to the container, you cross over these massive rocks and they have a bridge that leads up to the front door. And on the other side of the container, they've got a couple of outdoor amenities, including a hot tub, fire pit, solo stove, and a couple of lounging chairs, just providing max enjoyment of this stunning area and the view out the other side. And the property itself has some hiking trails that that lead to a cave and a waterfall, which we're excited to go check out. And just over the hill is their brand new shipping container wedding venue. So if there's a wedding in your future, you should definitely check it out. Now for the best part, the inside. Real quick, if you're a host of a unique or amazing Airbnb you want us to feature, you can go to journeymore.com and fill out the contact form. Please be sure to like the video, subscribe to our channel as we've got new videos coming out every week. Question of the video, we've shot all six box hops feature them on our channel so which one do you like the best and why be sure to comment your answer below and if you haven't seen our videos of the others go check them all out Woo. first thing you notice when you walk in is this is a completely different style than what you're typically used to mm -hmm. in a lot of these airbnbs that we travel to this is a mid-century modern just like nikki said earlier it is a total vibe in here. Mm -hmm. But the second thing are the giant windows that span across the whole front of the container with a beautiful view right outside. But down below is a giant glass floor to let you see that waterfall when it's rushing down. And it feels kind of crazy standing on top of it. I love that not only did they theme the inside, but they chose very upscale finishes and stunning pieces. Starting here in this living room, you've got a comfortable couch and two beautiful swivel chairs with a gas fireplace and TV, plus some fun, funky decorations. Behind us, we've got a large dining room table with a game cabinet behind it, record player, and then this adorable little bar with a couple of really cool bar stools that lead you into the kitchen space. You've got a full kitchen. Complete with a dishwasher, which we absolutely love. And a washer and dryer, so this place is loaded we love it and then again along this entire wall you have the huge windows and they also have that above the sink while you're in the kitchen so it's just views all around and there's a skylight in the kitchen which mm -hmm. just again adds to all that natural light coming in really making the space bright and happy there's two bedrooms in here the first one is on your left when you walk in it's got a pink vibe to it and then giant windows out to the side again with a little bit of a view in that one and it's a queen bed. And then the other bedroom is at the front right of the container, again with a queen bed, but this one's painted orange and probably has the best view of both bedrooms okay. right out front. And then they do have a full bath with a giant walk-in shower with a skylight above it. And not to mention the tiles are my favorite color, this bright, fun, and one of my favorite things that Seth and Emily do at all the box hops is they leave the ceilings exposed 
And so you get that container feel when you're in here, both with that and a couple of the walls. It's just such a cool design. And this video is super fun because we actually have a couple of friends coming to stay with us this time. So we are so excited for them to arrive and we'll get to have a little bit of fun because this is a perfect couples retreat. If you want to book the Elwood box yourself, we'll leave a link in the description below. Be sure to use our discount code when booking because it not only saves you money, but it also helps support us too. And if you're interested in seeing the five other shipping container homes, you can go to our channel and check out our tour of all of them. They each have their own style and feel and they're all absolutely amazing. So normally during our shoots, it's really tough to have friends come along with us, mainly because they happen during the week and we are just shooting and working the entire time. We had a very abnormally early check-in and so we were just working away and got so much done that we have a little extra time that we invited some friends and they're actually coming all the way from Tennessee last minute, so we are so excited. Gideon was a groomsman in my wedding, I was a groomsman in theirs, and I think we're going on 12 or 13 years of friendship together. So he's one of my oldest friends, and we always have the best time with them. It's gonna be so much fun. Okay, so it is currently 11.51, they should be here in about 10 minutes. I'm gonna film them coming in and then we will probably all crash, go to bed, and I'll update you in the morning. Good morning. We have woken up to a rainy day. It was so fun watching Alexis and Gideon wake up this morning, see the view, and look at the glass under their feet with the ravine below. And now we are cooking a breakfast for lunch and are gonna just enjoy some time together, hang out, play games, and see what the day brings for us. <laughs> Baker's dozen, baby. No baker's dozen. Oh. Is it gonna work? Oh my gosh, it's like a soup. <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna be interesting. Are right, we gonna get, uh, get, get a spatula? Lock a Kobe Jack. This is the money shot right here, dude. Ooh. Golden Ooh. brown. Ooh. Golden brown. It's actually, it was a baker's dozen. It's like 12 and a half. Because we got a, we got a two yolk egg. Yeah. Uh, waking up to the view was great. Um, I always love waking up to a big open window with treats. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> How often do you do that in your life? Uh, not very often, which is why it was so special. It almost looks like there's not a separation between you and the trees. That was really cool. Mm -hmm. Just felt like, oh, you're waking up with the niceness of a very cozy bed, but the view of Forest. Yeah. Cool. What do you yeah, think about that floor though? Oh, yeah. Glass floor. Mm. Yeah, what do you think? It's really cool now there's actually some water forming down there. So mm. that's pretty sick. I think it's great. Yeah. Uh, no, I like the floor. It's kind of trippy when you walk over it, but if you just stand and look down, it's not as bad. I personally feel like the chair just screams. You need therapy for me, right? <laughs> <laughs> it's the vibe. It's the right. It is. Plug. With the fire going. <laughs> Can you, are you getting our full bodies? Uh, I am now. Alright, I am six feet tall. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm pretty short. I was gonna say, yeah, I am not. <laughs> you would be like so and a half feet tall. <laughs> Extra feet.
the rain is lit up, so we're gonna pause the game, go out, enjoy the hot tub. We kind of already knew that I was gonna win anyway, so. Coming in fourth place is myself. At <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. 76 points. Okay, okay. Third place at 84 points. Hey, Dad. No way. I, I did that. Day. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I'll tell you the scores. Second place has 89 points and first place has 91. Woo, two, two points. Two point difference. Woo. I'm so stressed. The winner is Gideon. Yeah. Woo. Woo. So That's two absurd. points away. Yeah. That was good. Ooh. Woo. Is it good? It is delicious. Good. 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 Whoop, whoop. You had it on Tuesday? Yeah, on Tuesday. You thought it was better on Tuesday? Yeah. It was such a joy getting to spend time and make memories with our friends Gideon and Alexis. Mm -hmm. We are so thankful you guys came up. It was such a fun trip here yes. at this box up. We love every minute. If you wanna book this place for yourself, you can go to the link in the description below or go to theboxhop.com, but make sure you use our discount code because not only does it help you, but it helps us. And we so appreciate that. And then make sure that you like this video, subscribe to our channel, and comment below which box hop is your favorite and why. And as an added bonus to this amazing place, it sits on a beautiful property that has a little hike and a cave and waterfall. But one of the coolest parts is their brand new shipping container wedding venue called the 75. It is absolutely stunning. So if you're interested in that, you can go to theboxhop.com to find out more information.